I appreciate her probably more than she knows. She cares more about other people than she ever does herself. She did change my life, and, and Jack's changed my life. You know, I don't, I don't know what I would do without her. I can't imagine a life without both of them. Um, I just want her to know that, that I'm gonna spend the rest of my life taking care of her, and, and that's the, the main goal for me. that you'll be my stepdad. He helps me eat healthy food. Um, wrestle and have fun. And, and protects me for my whole life because I'm his best friend. Andrew is um, probably the yin to my yang. He finishes me because he's very soft-spoken and he's just very um, slow to anger. And he is an amazing person as far as the way that he loves me and that he loves God and that he loves Jax. I had prayed over that relationship for a very long time and I think once I saw him interact with Jax after the very first time, it was really obvious that he was a natural at it. And he is just the most involved, protective, um, loving, playful dad to him that I could have ever, I couldn't have prayed for anyone better. I just want him to know that I prayed for him so long before I even met him. I want him to know that I used to rock Jax to sleep at night and I prayed for the type of man he would be, the type of man that he would become, and the type of person he would help me be. And I truly know that he makes me a better mom, a better daughter, a better sister, a better person and a better Christian because of him. I've never had someone that handles me or holds me as accountable and expects a certain level from me and um, someone that truly challenges me every day and his main goal is to help me get to heaven. And I just never, um, I didn't know that someone so perfect will be made for me. A lot of times Ashley says it best that this wedding is going to be based about family because we are becoming a family with Jax and, and that's, that's what's really important to us. The wedding is all about our family. To have all of our family and friends and even our bridal party is all made up of family, sisters and brothers and a few friends, but mainly family and I just think that's really important to us and the whole day is about celebrating us becoming a little family. To Andrew's parents specifically and his sister and his brother-in-law and the girls, I just want them to know how they took Jax and I in and never skipped a beat with that, I think is remarkable and I feel so blessed to be a part of their family and just to know that they love us and that they've accepted us and is amazing. To my mom and to David and to my sister, 
I just, and her husband Tyler, I just want them to know that their support has been incredible. And then not to mention that how they have took Andrew in and how they've supported that relationship and just helped us has been um, amazing. To my dad and to Vicki, to Brock and to Summer, I just want them to know that the fact that they've just took Andrew in without missing a beat, and I don't know, I just feel like our families have really made us who we are. To my dad, I just think that he's been the best Christian role model I could have ever asked for, and he has set the bar so high for any man to come into that. And I think I've actually found, or I know that I've found the one that actually can reach those levels. I thank you for supporting me and Jax, especially during some of the rough times, and I just feel like our families have really made us who we are. God designed marriage to be an intimate relationship between a man and a woman, mentally, emotionally, physically, and spiritually. I've never met a father or son who was willing to give up their daughter or mother, so instead I ask, do we have your blessing for this marriage? We do, thank you. Lord, we're grateful for Sis and for Andrew and, and their example today, and Lord, we're just grateful for their love for you, and I just pray that you uh, continue to watch over them and as they embark on a new journey. And Lord, I just pray that you watch over them the rest of their lives. And Lord, we thank you most of all for Jesus, and it's his name I pray. Amen. Andrew, as I stand here before you in the presence of God and these witnesses, I, Ashley Simmons, take you to be my husband. Andrew, I promise to support your dreams, celebrate your accomplishments, and comfort you during your defeat. Andrew, I vow to love you, cherish you, and honor you in good times and in bad with all my heart until the end of our days. Jaxie, God tells me to train up a child in the way he should go, and when he is old, he will not depart from it. I promise to always do my best to support you to be the Christian man God has intended and love you through all of your stumbles and triumphs. Jax, the bond that you and I share is very special. And I want you to know that we will always have that, no matter the exciting changes that are in the days ahead. I love you. Ashley, as I stand here before you in the presence of God and these witnesses, I, Andrew Donahue, take you to be my wife. I never knew I could love someone the way I love you. You are truly an amazing person, and I'm so blessed God has given me a person I can love and call my best friend. I vow to love you, cherish you, and honor you in good times and bad, with all of my heart until the end of our days. Jax, I not only stand here and promise to be a loving and faithful husband, I promise to be a patient, loving, and caring father to you. I accept you as my own and promise to always be there for you, listen to you, advise you and love you until the end of our days. I give you this ring as a symbol of our love. For today and tomorrow and all the days to come. Wear it as a sign of what we have promised on this day. And know that my love is present. Even when I am not. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Andrew, you may kiss your bride. I love you. <laughs> it is my great pleasure and honor and privilege to be the first to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Andrew Donahue and Jax. I did it. What? I did it. <laughs> you want to stay here and watch it? Yeah.
got the grace of life the eyes of a child and everything about you drives me wild and when you cross my mind baby, about my where I'm at and lose my concentration start thinking about that Andrew, thank you for loving my sister Ann Jax with the purest form. Uh, you've been a dream come true for my sister, and you've been everything for Jax that you didn't have to be. Um, my family, we can never repay you enough, and we're so grateful that you're now a part of our life. Um, also, good luck, because you're going to need it. <laughs> I'm so happy that Andrew's found him somebody and you know it's just added a bonus that he gets to have Jax as well as part of the family. He's just like a brother to me so just wish y'all both the best of luck and welcome to the family. So, Cheers. <laughs> everyone that could be here today. And I really love that, that that my mom loves Drew and they will and Drew loves my mom and I hope that everyone has a good day tonight. Aww.